Last time I was on the show, I was virtual, but this time I'm here in person to clear my name. Last time I was accusing Dynasty of cheating on me with my brother, going to see men in jail. She says she only goes to the prison to visit her brother. I know for a fact she ain't go to see her brother because my brother was with her. My brother was in the car. Have you ever had sexual intercourse with any other man besides Matthew? She answered no, and it came back that Dynasty did not tell the truth. Wow. You knew about Man. that. You knew about that. Have you ever had physical sexual contact or sexual intercourse with Matthew's brother from the direct messages? She answered no. She did not tell the truth. I uh, kind of knew she was going to fail, so it wasn't a surprise to me. You know that's a lie. Well, come on. They're that, all, test is, that test is not accurate at all. Because I love Dynasty, and I don't see myself without her. I forgave her for the mistakes she made in the past. It's been six months, and now it's my turn to prove to her that I'm not cheating. I'll be staying late out at night in the car. She think I'm with females. I'll be with a whole bunch of guys. A couple months ago, Dynasty did find out that I was in the car with a girl, like driving around with her, but I was just dropping her home. But Dynasty, she think I had a whole relationship with this girl. I'm, I'm, I might have been sneaking behind her back to go see her. Even though I'm riding around with girls, I'm not cheating on her. It's to benefit me, like, financially. God dropped them off home, I get a couple dollars for gas money, and she's happy, and I'm happy too. It's been six months since the last show, and I want to know if she's been cheating on me. I already forgave her once. I don't think I could do it again. All right, Dynasty, the dirty bird is back. Um, so, you were on the show last time, and you were saying the results weren't accurate. Mm-hmm. You want to change that statement now? Nope. Come on now. Nope. Why are you lying? Because I'm not lying. Yeah. So, uh, when you were here before and you failed the test for sleeping with his brother, he couldn't be here, um, but now he's here and he was able to take a test. Why do you think he's cheating on you? Because he's a cheater. Why do you stay with a because... cheater? Because... Well, I mean, we know you're a cheater. Why do you stay with a guy that you think is cheating? Because we have a, a family. I try to make it work because, you know, we have a blended family. So I just keep thinking how it's going to affect the kids. If we split, how would it affect them? Are, you, are the two of you happy together? Yeah, like, you know, we have some parts where, like, we're fighting and, like, we're arguing. And it's because I just feel like he's just insecure. Yeah. And you were saying you have a blended family. Yeah, we have a blended family. And you family. blended his brother right into it, too. No, right? it was not. <laughs> First of all, if you want to get technical, if you want to get technical, the brother came before him. I didn't know they were brothers until I went started going to school with him. Right. So... Isn't that awkward around, the, like, Sunday night dinner? No. No? Mm -hmm. What happened three months ago? Instead of him being like, oh, you know, if you're gonna cheat, do it like smart. Like, don't just park up in front of the building with my car. Like, you get it? So I got a phone call from my siblings saying that, you know, he's in, a, in front of my building with a bitch in my car. So, you know, I get dressed, I'm not gonna lie. So I opened the light, pull her out, and I start beating her up. I'm not gonna lie, I start <laughs> It's just, it's like, it's like, now I just feel Did like. Did she have her clothes on? Yeah, she had her clothes on. Everybody know how I am. Why are you in my car? Because maybe he invited her in. Exactly. So you're going to get your ass whipped. Like, you, you get... That's like me saying, OK... But do you regret that? Do you no. regret beating her up? No, I don't. Do you, re do, you, do you regret that you're facing criminal charges? No, I don't. No. You don't feel bad for that girl? No, I don't. Did you beat her up bad? Yeah, I did. That's not good. I don't care. I don't care. Did he say that he did anything with this girl? No, but I know he's lying. So he said we weren't doing anything. What did he say he was doing with the girl? He said he only picked her up because he needed gas money. You needed gas but money. But why are you, you so upset with? that he might be cheating when you cheat? I don't cheat. Anything, no. any, listen, anything that I I'll, do... I'll say this. 
if she really didn't believe our lie detector test, she would not be back. Okay, so what if he fails his test? You gotta forgive him then, right? What? Yeah, because <laughs> he forgave you, you gotta forgive him. Anything... Keep that blended family going. No, anything I did, no, 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 no. Anything, anything I've done, we wasn't together when I did oh, it. Oh, come you on You get it? Now. When you're, listen, Steve, you a man, so you know anything, all right, you tell me it's over, you block me on social media, you're not caring about our family, so I'm gonna replace you. I cannot tell you to your face, I'll replace you. Well, we're, we're gonna find out. Let's bring Matthew out. What? What? This is crazy. What's crazy? That you cheat? What? That you cheat? I don't think I could do this a second time. All right, so we so we could be done. If you fail again, I All don't right. think I could do this a second time. All right, time. so we just break up. I guess. Facts. Do you want to break up with her? No. Do you love her? No. Yes. How do you? All right. All right. So all right, you fail. What's gonna happen? What you mean? If you fail later, what's gonna happen? If I, I'm not gonna fail. You sure? I know I told the truth. All right, we gonna see. And why would I bring a girl in front of, in front of our, our, our children late? Cause you don't care. That don't make no You're sense. That's my friend. Friend my ass. So anytime it's your friend, right? Anytime it's I your friend. I can't have no female friends, but you can hit up all the males what in your life. What you mean? You can have a female, just communication. Let me, let me ask you, area. why did you forgive her for sleeping with your brother and uh, I loved her since middle school, Steve, so I don't, really, I don't really see myself without her, so yeah. that's why I forgave her. Yeah, try so to make you're, things you're, work. And, 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 and since you forgave her, has things been good? Um, yes. Yeah. But she goes missing certain Sundays of the month, like first Sundays of the month, and it's kind of questionable. Where does she go? I don't know. She said she goes upstate to her cousin, but we all know what's upstate. Yeah. First of all, first of all. Now, hold on, hold on. Oh, hold on. I don't, I don't know what's upstate. What's upstate? A lot of correctional facilities. <laughs> oh, so she's, so she's go. you think she's going to visit. Now, do they give conjugal visits? That's if you're married. Oh, which, that's if you're married. Which she is. Oh, you're married. <laughs> hey, do you love him? You. Yeah, I love him, and but you I'm not wanna, in love. Let's, let's, come on. That's a two, that's two, being in love and loving somebody is two different things, Steve. Are you in love with them? No, I'm not. I'm not in love. When you hear her say that, how does that make you feel? Yeah, it makes me feel bad. Yeah. Why, why are you being so mean to the guy? Because I'm mean, I don't care. Wow. Come on, Dynasty, be nice. No. Were you in a car be with nice. the other woman? Steve, be nice. Yeah. I'm facing criminal charges right now, be nice. Yeah, Be because nice. you're whooping ass. Right. Nobody made you do that. Steve. Well, what were you doing in the car with that girl? Um, uh, my, my original intentions was to drop her off home so I'd get some gas money so she can go to work. Yeah. But, Did she you give you some gas money? No, she beat up. Yeah. <laughs> and you know she ain't giving you money after she gets her ass kicked, yep. right? Um, all right, so, Dynasty, you're up first. She took a lie detector test, and we asked her, since being on the show last, have you had sexual physical contact with any man besides Matthew? She answered no. Since being on the show last, have you had sexual intercourse with any man besides Matthew? She answered no. Since being on the show, have you gone to visit a man in prison and lied to Matthew about it? She answered no. The results came back all the same, and it came back that Dynasty told the truth. <laughs> Matthew came and took a lie detector test. So the examiner wrote notes at the very beginning. Matthew confessed to an additional woman that Dynasty does not know about. He had sexual intercourse with her twice last year. Then we went on to uh, give Matthew lie detector tests, and we asked him, 
since in a relationship with Dynasty, other than the two women you confessed about, have you had sexual physical contact with any woman besides her? He answered no. He told the truth. <laughs> since in a relationship with Dynasty, other than the two women you confessed about, have you had sexual intercourse with any women besides her? He answered no. He told the truth. <laughs> Did you have any sexual contact with the woman Dynasty caught you in the car with? He answered no. He did not tell the truth. Get this off of me right now. Get this off of me. Dynasty, it's not over. Dynasty, it's not I think over. you want, I think you want to hear this part. You no, want to come back out. Get it off. Hey, Dynasty. Off of me. There's uh, there's a couple more parts you might want to hear. Come on now. She, uh, he failed for having sexual contact with the woman that you caught, the woman that you whipped her ass. Um, so then the examiner made some more notes. After this examination was conducted, the examinee confessed to having sexual intercourse with the woman from the car five years prior to being in a relationship with Dynasty. Okay. So you had contact with her, but it was five years. Before I met Dynasty. Be five well, years I got before you relationship. Okay. Yeah. So that changes everything. But so then we went on to test you about it. While in a relationship with Dynasty, did you have sexual physical contact with a woman from the car? You answered no. While in a relationship with Dynasty, did you have sexual intercourse with the woman from the car? You answered no. The results came back the same, and it came back that Matthew told the truth. All right, get this off me. We're done. Good luck. Right. Hey, Matthew. Good luck to you, buddy. Thank you. Click here to watch more Wilco's. Click here to subscribe and get a front row seat for all the action. Can you relate to this story? Go to www.stewilcos.com to get my help.